What's going on, guys? JV Fitness here. Uh, bringing another video to you guys. Um, this video is going to be another review um, of a product I got the other day. It is for the gym, like it should be, because this is a channel for the gym, even though there's never any gym footage on this channel. It's always just these videos. Might as well be a fucking review channel, actually. Um, but, yeah, it's something you guys will probably most certainly like. Um, and like to know about, it is, these aren't in here because the plastic's not in here anymore. It's these. I bought myself a pair of wireless Bluetooth headphones. Um, really cool. Really nice size actually for what they are. You don't put them over your head, you put them behind your head. So they go on like that. Just sit on top of your ears just like that. On these you have, you can use them as hands free for your phone as well. You've got the answer phone, hang up your phone, volume up, volume down, next song. Um, like just skipping the songs and that two buttons next and previous. Um, there are also ways on this that you can do a call back to the last person that rang you, but I've actually lost a bit of paper for these already to tell me where it was, so I'll just have to look that up on uh, the interwebs. But um, just a few things about them. Um, they have 400 hours of standby time, so just like this, just, oh, if I was to turn them on, literally to turn them on, all you do is that, and you'll hear a little beep. Obviously, if on your ears, that beep will be louder. Um, but then all that I'll do is that flash, just like that. It keeps flashing, and to turn them off, you do just exactly the same until you hear the noise again and it's a red light this time but then the red light goes away straight away. Um, talking time, if you're going to use them for the phone uh, um, as like a hands free for your phone or as um, listening to music you have 20 hours. Still, 20 hours for a pair of wireless headphones is very good. The way that you charge them it's got its own little charging port up here so you literally just Peel that back, just in there, under this little rubber coating, is where you charge it. It's, I don't, that's not a mini USB, but it's something along a similar sort of lines of a miniature USB. Um, but the battery in this is lithium, lithium polymer, um, it's rechargeable. Uh, I believe they said it's rechargeable. They said you can recharge it for 300 times or something, but not being funny, I've never found anything. There's one that said you can recharge it for 300 times, it'll then start to die. I've never had anything like that. I've had a pair of like these before. Um, said you could only charge them for, I think it was like 100 times or something. Those were only like eight pound and they went past a hundred they went up to like 200 but um, I lost them in the gym uh, these ones good quality and I'd like to see if you can comment down below how much you think they cost and I'll put it up on the screen and I will say it at the end just in case I forget um, but yeah no it's uh, the Bluetooth uh, specification is uh, class 2 up to 10 meters, that's in an open space. So, does that mean in a field? What the fuck does that mean? Um, if it is in a field, then good luck. Don't see why you'd be leaving your phone around, but you're in a field to do what the fuck you want to do. Um, you've got it says 10 metres, so I'm guessing indoors with some walls and shit in the way, like obstacles for the Bluetooth to go through. 
I believe it's going to go down to about five. But not being funny, most people are going to have the phone in the pocket and just use it like that. Um, it also says here that the maximum operating range depends on the paired phone model and the battery power and environmental factors. So that's basically just a load of bullshit saying if you if you have a good phone it will last longer than if you have not a not so good phone don't think that's true um, yeah no I'll get these I'll start them for you just to show you, show you how to do it um, show you how they all start up and everything this is the box it comes in they're uh, just just top or is it just op or just top, whatever the fuck it is. Literally everything I just read was off the back. Got a little Bluetooth sign there. And that'll be on the side. Bottom, nothing. And it's just got a few little things at the bottom. There. So, with these, all you're going to do is, obviously with the alpha lead background, you're just going to drag get up your Bluetooth, turn your Bluetooth on so you get all your paired devices up and everything and because I've already had it there before I don't have to search for it I can just turn them on you'll hear the beep that was very quiet so you may not hear it but I'll put it on the screen as a beep when it happens see I haven't pressed anything and it's already connected so, literally all I'm going to do is just play a song that I listen to in the gym through these. Um, these can only go up to a certain volume. Uh, if I was to turn them, if I was to turn them down quickly, one second. Um, one second, let me just turn them down. There. Um, see? That's then not playing. I turn them up by the headphone and it'll go. It beeps every time you turn them up. One second. Yeah, so it stops itself at a very, very low volume. Um, literally, if I was to go on my phone and press the volume up just to get the volume up on, it comes up at that. So it goes up about three fourth, not even that, a sixth of the way maybe. It hardly touches the volume control at all. You can hear it a little bit. But then if I turn it up full volume, they are very loud. Good headphones, really good. I can't hear a word I'm saying at the moment. But that's those. You've got, you can do the change song there pause play but I've just paused it so, it's, they are, not being funny guys, I've used them for the gym a couple times now, they're, they're great. I use them for squats, they're loud enough for squats, I use them just for when I do my normal exercise and that in the gym, they're good for that as well. Everything I do, 
I've kept them in my bag now just in case. When I'm at work and on my break, I'll stick them on and just listen to music. Um, everything else, guys. Any more questions about them? Stick it down in the comments or message me on YouTube. Um, yeah, so after all that, they were £15. It was free shipping. For the quality that they were, that's not bad. Um, other than that, it's, it's going to be probably a couple videos up today, or one or two, or one up today, one up tomorrow. Um, but currently, just sat here. Hello. Uh, it just got the old YouTube's up over there. My new intro that I done the other day. All the videos I've recently put up and everything. If you want to, go fucking subscribe, bitches. Just go on the old YouTube's and type in JB Fitness. It'll come up. I believe the picture is me in my Gymshark t-shirt and my Gymshark compression. Or, if you want to be a really good follower and subscriber, go hit up jbfitness.jb on Instagram. It's very small at the moment, just 27 posts, 24 followers and 88. I'm following 88. Really trying to grow this. Uh, it's got a link in the bio to my YouTube channel. There's pictures of me. There will be like... I don't do them all the time, but that's one I took yesterday. 23 likes. Three days ago, 24. Some of them are really cool. Like, I'll put this sort of thing on there, it won't just be me. I had, I had Emily Sky on there. Uh, it's diff all different things, guys, like the food. Uh, this one was telling you to go check out the YouTube channel and the video was at the bottom and it's also at the top here where the locate where the current location is. Um, there's some photos from the photo shoot and that. All these different things. That's another one from the videos. Just telling you to go check it out. Um, other than that, guys, I haven't really got much to say. So um, yeah, as always, coffee and orange. Great way to start the day off, guys. Remember.